Sogre waji zimai, uh, potu wangu yamba umene kwa mawa yamba buino. Uh, Pofu ni ganditu uti kulimbi ika uti izi ntuzi mene zikainga di eh, zajeva. Eh, Dedi taukondu ila uti zitaka uti antuonse, uh, akukala, buino buino popa nda jina yacho vutikira. Njala ya ata mafuta saa kusawa magesi, saa kutima tima zose ziri munubwini. No, um, I, I, I think this is a much better report. Anyway, so uh, we'll discuss when we meet at, four, at five. Yeah, thank you. I don't know how to feel about this job. Now I'm placed at this position where I'm president. How much can I do in the time allocated? That is my word. It's heavy on me because my feeling is that we've wasted 50 years. There's been very little progress in changing the status of people at grassroots. It's heavy, but I'm able to carry it. Why? Because I'm an African woman. An African woman carries heavy loads. Anyway, that's how we are trained. We are brought up that nothing is unbearable. In five years' time, what I would like to see is a Malawi where people can speak freely, human rights are respected, there's no corruption, no nepotism. I want to see a Malawi where at household level, people are living a better life by encouraging entrepreneurship, by supporting small business. We're just discovering that we have huge deposits of natural resources in this country, minerals and oil and gas. I want to ensure that Malawians are the beneficiaries. That's where we need to be going as a nation. I had come from an abusive marriage and I had walked out of that marriage at a time when people didn't walk out of abusive marriages. An African woman, you are supposed to stay regardless. In 1983, I made a fine man and then got married again. I just thank God. I had a very, very strong grandmother. She was a woman who stood for her rights. She's the one who told me, don't allow men to step on you. I don't understand how this country has depended on other people for money. And we've been begging and begging. The tragedy is that we will be dependent on aid for a while if our, our friends and our international partners don't come. That if they packed up today and left, we are dead. Ladies 
and gentlemen, this lady has made history. She's the first female president of the Republic of Malawi. She has inherited uh, a challenging environment. Malawi is on a journey to transformation. The EU would like to convey a signal of our willingness to support the government. 63 million euro of EU funding will support two interlinked government initiatives. I had to get back on course with the IMF, devalue our culture uh, by 40%, and I'm grateful because some of this money that goes towards uh, cash transfer will help cushion the shock that that devaluation has brought about. The president has been a busy person here in Brussels, moving from one meeting to another. And hoping that uh, in 18 months we'll be able to look back and see the success stories. Very nice to meet you. director of Irish Aid. Mm -hmm. And as she goes back to Malawi, a lot has been achieved as the European Union has released about 98 million euros in aid that will go straight to agriculture as well as the social cash transfer in the face of devaluation of the Malawi Kwacha. I believe we have so much to learn from China. How is China? Hello, how are you? We need to develop our nation. So we need to go to China. First of all, I would like to introduce Mr. Cheng. He's the board chairman of Fujian Fertilizer Company and also he's the board chairman of Shandong Oil Company. One of the five sectors that are going to help us fast track our economic recovery is agriculture. China will decide today we shall develop this. The next day you sign and work starts. We know that if it had been in the Western world, we would have been talking for two years. Before we give you, you must do this and that. Things that are not related to the project. And that's what China doesn't do. Maga maga kuna kwa Afrika. Ndiyo amene ama kila nchito kwa mbili kuti mwana kule. My message was time has come for women of this country to do what? To become economically empowered. Maga maga amene mai uja pa muzipaji wabirikana ana ajala wa school wapita utauni. Osa iwala makuru kumbuzia. Na chokweza kwa mbila president. Zigu Sinta, ba nyezi mene hi ndem ba meeting kati kwa ba sasa sana kuzatu kuli da vote. Omadala na kuti zigu Sinta, jiko zauka, osa ba sasa sana kuzatu kuli da vote. Kuli kuli kuna kuti kwa zana di tuone mtu hi na kuda mene ngali tandis. 
I've already told Malawi it's not going to be easy. What you are seeing in the press is not the real situation. If at the end of two years we have run and run, and then the people of Malawi say, no, we're not satisfied, we can't re-elect you, that's fine. I must do the best that I can. <laughs>